Skid Hey, we're back. This is Tori Rainey. Say hello. Hello. Who's this? Karen. Karen who? Gary. Gary, yeah. Duh. Gary, Gary, Gary. <laughs> and uh, we're shooting a project here on Skinheads. Skin Today we're going to show you how skinheads are a subculture. And uh, how is this subculture? Because they have their own way of living life. Skinheads. The skinhead movement began in Great Britain during the late 60s and has spread to the United States as well as Germany and other Western and Central European states. The term skinhead refers to the shaven heads of its members. In the United States, skinhead members generally range from 11 to 23 years old. The estimated number of American skinheads varies from 3,000 to 5,000, but there are as many as 10,000. Skinhead uniform consists of Doc Martin boots, which are called docks, suspenders, tattoos, and flight jackets. They wear green military pants or black jeans. Emblems sewn on their jackets usually consist of swastikas, Celtic cross, and an American flag on one shoulder, and on the opposite shoulder, and a Confederate flag. And, of course, Slayer t-shirts. I lost microphone privileges. <laughs> Where do you think they convene, Tori? Well, they convene in warehouses where they do their drugs, party, and they drink alcohol. And drugs. drugs. And drugs. these are ages from 11 to 30. <laughs> and yeah. drugs. Drugs. Thank you. Dance. They do dancing. Well, they, they do the dancing. Yeah, uh, they hit, when they play the crazy dance. music and they just mosh pit and go in circles all crazy. Pretty crazy. Yeah. Like a and, you know, Slayer. It's like a Slayer. Mosh pit to Slayer concert. Yeah, if you've been to Slayer Dang. concerts, you know. There's stuff on Stuff on Yeah. Uh, so what I find interesting about it is that like I, like because of that like they think that one race is superior to all the others that, that's like a cocky little bitch right there <laughs> and that's like they're mean people how are they mean? they kill other races they just don't like other races and they don't like other races I think they believe because in their own they believe in their own godly your, power is this your interview? <laughs> Torch and yeah, other evilness. I kind of find it interesting in a sick sort of way. And what I dislike is that they hurt people because it's all about peace and love. <laughs> well, what interests me the most is that they, uh, they're, since they're all some culture, they, they date back until like the late 60s and stuff. They all believe in their own thing. And if that's like part of America, you believe in no thing. I don't support them, what their causes and what they do. But, uh, you know, it's pretty cool. I mean, if, that, if that's what you're into, I guess, go ahead and do that. I mean, uh, no one to judge. Right, Tori? Yes. What I like about skinheads are uh, their tattoos, of course. Um, <laughs> I like how they, like, how they like think they're superior to everybody and stuff. Like, mm. alright, well, what, what I dislike is the violence. Like, yeah, I don't like violence that much. What else, Tori? Um, what do you dislike? Do you like their shaven heads? Uh, do you think just, that's a good style for them? It's just not my style. I don't like the shaved heads at all. But you do wear the Slayer, and you have a tattoo. Yeah. Oh yeah, and I like how the how they like Slayer. Yeah. <laughs> They can be in warehouses where they just can have it all. They can. So where do they convene? Well, <laughs> we came to wreck everything and ruin your life. God sent us.